Okay. So uh, this is the Neuromuscular Biomechanics Laboratory. Uh, this facility is a collaboration between EHHD and the College of Engineering. Uh, there's a faculty member over there that works out this lab as well. And so some of the main technology we use is uh, 3D motion capture. So you can see all these cameras up on the wall. They're all emitting kind of a near-infrared light. That light goes off, bounces off of the reflective markers that we place on our participants. Uh, and then we can track the position of those markers in 3D space. Um, we put enough markers on the body on very specific bony landmarks that we can accurately then track the position of a tibia or a thigh. If we know those two positions, we now know what the knee is doing. Um, and so you can see over here, kind of the 3D skeleton recreated. So Chris says you squat or walk up and down, and you can see the tracks. Um, exactly how he's moving. So that's how we record the motion of the participant. Um, some other tools that we commonly use. On uh, the bottom screen you can see this uh, burst of activity. Basically muscle contraction is just an electrical signal. We can measure that electrical signal. So we can see when the muscles come on, when they go off, relatively how on they are, how active they are during different activities. And then the last real piece of information we use, um, Chris wants to jump up and down. Um, these red forces that are popping up and down as he jumps. Um, we have five plates in the ground there that can measure the ground reaction force that he applies to the ground. And so if we combine all of this information, we can get a really detailed picture of exactly how somebody's moving, what the muscles are doing, and what are the forces being applied to their body. 